it is where like everything lands. It's why you practiced. Like you you came there to calm down. You came there to breathe. You came there to have a moment. And um, and people just leave. They leave before it. They leave in the middle of it. Um, we don't take a lot of time. I mean, I take very little time to just sit down and just like be with yourself and just don't do anything. It's not even that you have to meditate. You literally have to do nothing in Shavasana. Yeah. The whole point is to rest and to allow like all of the blood flow and the stretching and the breath and the mindfulness you've built to just settle. And so it's honestly like breaks my heart. People will leave and like wave at you like goodbye thank you for class and i'm like no you didn't do the best part you didn't do like the actual thing that you came here for yeah and it's really hard to explain Uh, people just really have a really hard time being still and they consider um yoga a lot of people i think still is like a workout to many folks especially hot yoga what i teach and so um they're there for all different kinds of reasons so someone who's there maybe for abs <laughs> is not going to care about laying there at the end. But I really, I always hope that it shifts for them and it becomes about something more than abs and it becomes about actually resting yourself. Yeah. And I, th- I think I, 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 I totally agree a hundred percent with what you, cause I've been there. I've been to the person who wants to get out of there during Shavasana. So you can understand it completely. When I've people been do it. there. Right. Right. I mean like everyone has to go through that. Yeah. I think to get to where they appreciate it. 